Good morning, everybody. It's Pastor Bonnie, and we are going to be starting um, lesson number five, part five of our angel painting lesson. And <clears throat> you can see we've actually got quite a bit done on it. We have the flowers in the foreground done right here, and then we started working on the dress. I was actually going to put a bouquet of flowers in the angel's hand, but I think I'm just going to put a beautiful flower that just trails down. Um, today, what I want to work on, I want to teach you how to do the angel wings, and that's almost my favorite part. Um, and I had the neatest thing happen. I always pray over these videos because I want people to be blessed. I always have my beautiful worship music going so that you can worship the Lord with me because when we do the things we love, it's actually an act of worship to the Lord. So it's just relaxing and peaceful and I hope you enjoy it as much as I do and I welcome you into my kitchen. And um, so anyway, I was going to tell you this morning, the Lord woke me up around 4 o'clock in the morning and I have I always pray about the title for this for these videos and this one she is it's her name is lyric and it's going to be the angel of music and so what i saw was her just worshiping and dancing in a field of flowers and then the scripture came to mind that said look at the flowers of the field and how beautiful they are and it just and for those of you who might be worried or discouraged or having a hard time today God is able to take care of every need you have. So I want to share that with you. And then these, I, I actually just bought a whole bunch of new paint at the store. And I actually, I happen to get these at Walmart, but I'll show you there. These are just the apple barrel ones. I love these. And they're very inexpensive. They're only like 50 cents a piece. Um, I do like to use the more expensive, really thick paints if I'm going to be <coughs> doing work with a palette knife, but for these type of paintings, I love these. So here's our palette today, and I'll try to lift it up so you can see. See all the colors? Um, I'm really excited to use these. So we're going to start with the wings. And I like to just sketch them out first. So we're going to start with a white paint. I'm just going to move myself out of the way here so I have a little more room. I lay out all my paintbrushes on the table. I have some water and then you saw I just use a paper plate. But, um, the brush is just a pointed brush. Let me just see if I can bring this a little bit closer. So we're going to start at the shoulder. And I always start with just a sweeping motion. And this is just an outline. I'm going to go back and fill it in after. It's hard to get the other side to get, look about the same. I have actually seen angels, you guys, and um, I will tell you, I just feel like I can't even do the paintings justice for the beautiful angels I've seen. and. Most of the time, the ones I see appear in human form. And there's a scripture verse that talks about to um, entertain strangers because you might actually be entertaining an angel unawares. And I, my experience with them has been that the ones I've, a lot of the ones I've seen are dressed in regular clothes and the message their message to me is how they're dressed. So I have seen a few with the beautiful big wings, but um, a lot of them are just like regular, they look like people. 
and angels are sent to they're sent as messengers they send us blessings from the father they give us wisdom and insight they actually carry our prayers back to the father so angels are amazing and important but we're never to worship them because they are created beings just like we are so angels worship the father just like we do and they're they're messengers they don't they don't want us to worship them and we do all have a guardian angel because i know i've actually seen mine um that's actually in the book that i wrote <clears throat> it's called angelic encounters and listing help from heaven so if you want to read some of the angel stories they're all in my book but angels are much at work in our lives and they are beloved by all races and religions and many many people have had experiences with them so they are real And I'm enjoying spending this time with you. I'd love to hear the music while we work on it together. So <clears throat> right now, <clears throat> I'm just getting the outline. I'm sorry, I have allergies this morning. You can see they're just really much easier than you think working on the wings. And I'm gonna change out the paintbrush and I'll show you which one I'm gonna use. I have my favorites. This one's a flat, it's a small flat one. And I like to water down the white paint to do the wings because I want to go back and I'm hoping to maybe put some sparkles in there. So this is just watered down right now because I kind of want the blue to show through. feels like coloring you guys it's it's kind of like when you have those really fun coloring books that's really all it is you just color in around and you can see this isn't a hard it's not hard any of these techniques anybody can do them you just have to take your time and enjoy the process
what I'm doing now is just doing little strokes that kind of look like feathers. So we can see that we're really getting the, um, the wings are starting to come along nicely. And I'm just going to, um, you just keep going back until you get the depth of the white that you want. You might decide that you like it just like that. But I actually think I want to add just a little more to it. this hand be behind her dress. So we're gonna put a little more white on her dress. And it's a pinafore, so I, I didn't want it to be form-fitting. I just want it to be gentle and pretty and flowing. Just adds more and more and more 
depth and dimension. That's what's so much fun about doing these. And you can stop these and start these. And like I was telling you guys, this one's the fifth one, but I'm also, I'm gonna do one at the very end that has all of them all together so you can either do each one of the segments and stop them and take your time or you can go ahead and um, do the one at the end where it goes all the way straight through so see we have our angel she's really starting to come to life I just love how this one's coming out and I do have if you do like these painting lessons I actually have them in books too you can get them on Amazon they're called friends and gems and um, that was another idea that the Lord he wakes me up with the neatest ideas so he woke me up with this idea for these friends and gems classes and you just get together with your friends your grandkids your church groups um, I actually want to try to take them into the prisons and work with women or just you know, teen challenge, people who just need a leg up, need some help. But the they are painting lessons. Um, I have jewelry classes. I have um, soap making. There's one in there for pressed flowers if you want to learn how to do that. So they're they're all under the title Friends and Gems, and they're by they have my name. It's Bonnie McPhail. And if you look on Amazon, you type my name and you'll see all of them. But they, um, they always have a Bible study in them or something about personal growth. Because I love to help people uncover their dreams and head toward them. There's no greater joy than being who God created you to be. So I think we have our angel done. And I'm going to let her dry and then we're going to come back. I do want to put some more flowers in the front and we're going to be working on the mid part of the painting. And then we're going to finish her hair. But we're actually coming along nicely and I have so enjoyed spending this time with you. Thank you so much. And my prayer and my hope is that this is relaxing and joyful for you. And you will find your own song. And this is starting to look like an angel. She's coming to life, and her name is Lyric. She is the angel of music, and remember that God is able to provide all your needs. And I love you all, and I appreciate this time together. Thank you so much.